Good morning, fellow explorers. I'm glad to be alive today, and I hope that you are too. We're beginning our next week of digital control, but this week we're adding Antar Kumba, or internal retention, to all the practice. So let's see how we get to it. Our mudra of the day is Jaya Mudra. It's fists, crossed wrist at your chest. It's the sign of victory. Okay, Asana Jaya, victory in the postures. Pranayama Jaya, victory in the breath control. Samadhi Jaya, victory in the meditations. All right, so let's get our seat. Relax into that space. Take a few breaths. An Anuloma, which is longer exhale than inhale, cleanses the nasal passages. So let's see how we do that. The first technique is to train us to delicately prolong the exhalation by having open nostril inhale and then narrowed nostril exhale. So let's just do three rounds of that to get used to what we're talking about, especially for the beginners. So exhale your breath and inhale, open nostril. Now narrow both nostrils and exhale. Inhale, open nostrils. Narrow both nostrils and exhale. Exhale always longer than inhale in Anuloma. Third one, open both nostrils, inhale. Narrow both nostrils, exhale. All right, so that's the basic beginning technique, and then we move to the alternate nostrils as the variations off of that. So let's enter into the yoga myth, the yoga dream that comes from the core of our deep wisdom body, which is what our biological gut inheritance is, plus the head thinking systems. So you bring that all together, and that's what gives you the vision of the idea. All right, so let's begin. Exhale your breath. Raise the hand. Open both nostrils. Breathe in. And block the left. Hold the breath. Open right nostril. Exhale. Both nostrils open. Inhale. Wait there and Antar Kumbhak. Block the right, open the left, exhale. Relax the hand and restorative breath. Any complaint or resistance that we have comes from the fact that the status quo of the ego has to go for real change to occur. And since the ego is the intention of protection, it doesn't want to go. Let's whittle it away. Second cycle in the first round. Restorative exhale, raise the hand, open nostril, inhale. Wait there. Five to seven seconds for a beginner, 10 to 15 for more advanced student. Then block the left, open the right exhale. Open both inhale. Wait there in internal retention. Block the right, open the left, exhale. And relax your hands, restore the breathing. Since we have to do both nostrils, we're only doing two cycles instead of three. So what guides you is your intention, your sankalpa, and the support that you summon from the unseen world, which is the world of spirit, and you have to learn to make that real, as real, as tangible as the material plane. All right, second round, it's going to be open nostril, inhale, hold the breath, partially closed alternate nostril, exhale. Let's get to it. Exhale the breath, raise the hand, open both nostrils, inhale, wait there and on back.
Now block the left, partially close the right exhale. Open both, breathe in. Wait there and on Turkumbak. Block the right, partially close the left exhale. And drop the hand and restore to breathing. The last few sessions, we've been going over the different chittabhumis or states of consciousness. We said that people begin with the monkey mind, excited, agitated, rajasic, then the donkey mind, tamasic, dull, lazy, and then the butterfly mind, fluctuating back and forth. And then finally, we get to ekagra, the one pointedness, the kind of sattvic tendency where we learn to focus our mind and it stays with whatever we put it or wherever we direct our attention. So, something to rely on, have confidence in, and to rest in, that ability to focus your mind in yoga. Second cycle, second round, exhale breath, raise the hand, open both nostrils, breathe in. Wait there, Nantar, come back. Block the left, narrow the right, exhale. Open both, breathe in. Hold the breath. Block the right, narrow the left, exhale. Relax your hand and restore to breathing. You know, one of the bhavas or attitudes or ambiances that you create within yourself and your own vibration is to realize there's something, always something to be happy about. So find something in the moment to be happy about and be happy. Sounds too simple, right? All right, now we're going to the next round, which will be partially closed, both nostrils on the inhale, hold the breath, partially closed, alternate nostril, exhale. Two cycles of that. Let's get to it. Check your sitting posture again. Mula moves to Swadhisthana. How do you take your first chakra and move it towards your second chakra, which means an upward action? Same time, there's a downward action in the back from second chakra to first chakra. And then align them by bringing the navel into the body, like Tadasana, and widen your heart chakra. If the heart, mid-thoracic cardiac spine doesn't widen, the Vishuddha, the neck has no room. All right, exhale the breath, raise the hand. Narrow both nostrils, breathe in. Hold the breath. Then block left, narrow right, exhale. And both nostrils partially closed, breathe in. Wait there in Antar Kumbak. Block the right. Partially close the left. Exhale. Do not let any breath escape the closed nostril. And drop the hand and restore to breathing. Now, when the energy in the form of the breath neither goes out from the center of the body or comes back in on the inhale, it simply expands into the center in a non-dual, non-discursive awareness, and that's called the attainment of bhairava, the fierce state of emptiness. Let's see if we can experience it one more time in the pauses between the breath. Exhale. Raise the hand. Narrow both nostrils, breathe in. 